Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh my brothers and sisters watching at home I am Azim I'm Amnan formerly known as my muslim umma Today what we're going to be talking about we're going to be talking about terrifying signs of kiamah okay the end of the world and why it is near so number 1 narrated from a hadith which will all be descriptive down below in the description prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam had mentioned that people for from arabia would actually be competing of building the tallest buildings in the world you see that the burj khalifa the i've Jidda seen tower. the burj khalifa i've seen the tower jira tower in all Jidda. being built right now they're competing to be one of the first to build the highest skyscrapers number 2 sexual deviations on the rise what do you think about that i think it's a disaster why because how come when one is born as uh, let's say i'm a born i'm born a guy but then i want to switch myself to a woman how that, does that work i mean i'm not sure how that works but for me it's more of sexual deviations as in they are kind of going against the norm in society as in maybe they are uh, legalizing uh marriage of the same sex i don't know you know it's quite confusing to me is what i would consider to be what i wouldn't do so just move on from that what is number 3 number 3 is actually riba increase in riba so nowadays you see interest which is of course haram but so called muslim bank islamic banking tries to tend to kind of what twist the words of twist the, the, word, the, the hadith to try and make it halal yeah they say right? what, banking fee yeah they try to banking. make it halal well we all know it's very haram so number 4 we have leaders that leaders will be those who are corrupted I'm not going to say any names right but no, uh, but leaders not only the non muslims but also the muslims they might misguide they, we actually have some of it going on in malaysia right now but we're not going to say any names we're going to try and keep it as low key as possible last but not least those which is halal will tend to be known as haram and that of which is haram will be that considered to be halal and plus from that and we've seen this everywhere muslim brothers drinking alcohol they go for zina they do all of the things and the problem is they expose themselves exactly what does this teach to the other people you know exactly our generation it's quite weird when i see the muslim umma especially malaysians you know a muslim dominated society tend to um associate themselves with drinking and all these you know zina fornication all that is quite quite sad to hear but and it's quite sad to see and those basically are the terrifying signs that we are all experiencing right now in this day and age which is just a step closer to kiama and yeah i think this what many people forget we are living in the end of time prophet has mentioned us about this so long ago like 14 14 hundred years 1400 ago 1400 years, years ago he mentioned this to us very early on and even with us knowing these things we still don't do anything about it we still it. don't do anything we exactly. ignore it you know and exactly. these signs what is it you know like why all of this here well these are here because they are exactly. preparing us and prepare us for the antichrist the dajjal. antichrist the arrival of dajjal these He, signs not oh, sorry okay, you okay i'll go dajjal will come when everyone is corrupted when the world is you know like out of their religion even the muslims so this is the perfect time for him to come he is one of the major signs let surely the kiamah is near so we are just saying be ready you know i think these signs all correlate to the fact that the dajjal will arrive and the world when it is fully corrupted and when we least expect it like the prophet said the world is a uh, heaven for those who disbelieve and hell for those who believe so when the world is heaven for everyone that's when the dajjal will arrive correct this has been azim amnan 
thank you so much for tuning into our video do check back next week and we might have more content for you guys inshallah inshallah this is my muslim ummah signing out right now assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh my brothers and sisters